Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, I guess. Um, I am here with Chris and Zeno. Greetings. Hello. We are watching episode 5. It's been, I don't know, how weeks, months, until I've actually seen this. So I deeply apologize in my behalf. Um, I have been busy and distracted with school and other things so i really do apologize but anyway guys make sure to subscribe and leave a like if you guys haven't already and without further ado we are gonna get into episode five okay so the last thing that i do remember is um the kids were kidnapped Wait, you remember? <laughs> Holy crap. I have no clue. I can watch all over again and just have no clue. I remember that the kids were kidnapped. Um, we did get the kids back, but we also saw the fiery phoenix. I believe so. Let's get this started. The cool intro. What's more urgent than the stuff here? But I mean, we're a kingdom. We have to travel out to the other nation. Okay. But what's been so urgent that you're gone for two weeks? <laughs> yeah, that's a little hard to explain at the moment. <clears throat> I am sorry, though. You know? Oh, yeah, bird warning, guys. <laughs> you're fine. Am I interrupting something? No, no, Chris, no. What's up? Oh, I actually thought that was Chris for a second. <laughs> yeah, it might be a little difficult. I mean, but it's, yeah. just past, it's past me. Oh, you know, when I first... Futures happened. When I first knew Chris, this was the character I knew mm -hmm. him as. It was very weird. It's, um, I just had a quick word with my Enderman friend. She had to... Uh, and your man friend. She had important matters somewhere else. Ah, oh, yeah, I was gonna ask, where is she at? Christian <laughs> man! Akira, you know! Christian man! So nice! <sighs> anyway. Um, Akira, you stay down here with Ace. That's okay. Mmm. <laughs> I'm just not gonna question. Okay. You know why I'm laughing. I'm not gonna say anything, but I'm, you know why I'm laughing. Okay. Come on, guys. We gotta talk about something. Okay, what are we gonna do about that phoenix? We have to get it back. You do realize what that means, right? And where we have to go to accomplish that goal. Yes, we have to go to basically a death sentence and go to basically our father's home. Just hang on, hang, hang on a second. We're going after a someone, bird. someone or something that we know nothing about and that has shown hostility toward us. Sounds about right. Uh huh. You see where I'm going here? Yes, but technically, it could be a good asset to us. If we have a phoenix, it could actually help us. And if he has the phoenix, we're screwed. You're screwed no matter what. Not in a good way. Basically, I mean, having the Phoenix is pretty good for your army. I know the whole regenerating thing, but exactly. keep in keep in mind it takes time from the legends. And again, we don't know what the Phoenix <coughs> is like. We don't know if they'll help us. We don't know what 
is gonna happen? Well, he could usually use that thing for. I mean, for what? Me. He put wings on me. What's what's gonna do with your nether army with that thing? He can make it where his nether army could regenerate. Then we'll be really, really messed up. It'd be an ending never war. All right, all right. I get your point. The question is, how are we gonna? How are we gonna get in and out without him noticing and killing us? Ah, uh, dress up as his army people. Knock them out. <laughs> get their stuff. <laughs> what? Oh, uh, well, well, it's a classic, but it works. I mean, you're not wrong. Exactly. I know my blood. Well, okay. So, from what I gathered from this, like, the phoenix escaped. And both parties are, like, trying to find it. So, it's like... Got it. We'll all dress up as phoenixes, and then we'll, you know, go back in, right? Uh, no one's gonna notice. <laughs> They're not gonna know which one's the real phoenix, right? It's funny how Xena was a part of this, and she does not remember anything about this. Well, no, I actually wasn't a part of it. Uh, that's the great part. You were Enders. No... Quick, give Xeno Groucho Marx glasses. No, I really wasn't there. That's she the thing. She was there. Life over the past ten years has not been great, but I am still partial to living. Do you want me to begin? Anywhere. Anywhere can help us here. Well, without turning this into a long, drawn-out story, Please do not. You, know, you know very well what happened to me. Yeah? I mean, we got a living example of an experiment right here. And Dr. <laughs> And if my father, Lord Shadow, is anything like Dr. Hojo... <laughs> Did he just seriously go- Oh my gosh. Yes. Then I fear it's worse than I thought it could ever get. So it is with that said, I think you should send me so I can have a word with a father. I'm not sending you alone. I'm not asking. Well, I'm, I'm telling you, no. <laughs> I'm not Sage. sending you, no. I'm not asking, I'm telling you. We go together. I'm not putting you in danger. I'm, I'm not putting the doctor in danger or anyone else. Well, I don't care. I'm not letting you put yourself in danger. We go as a family. We go as a team. We know this. We never do anything alone. That's what Silver Moon's about. Doing things together. Yes. That's true. Getting back to the point at hand, though. I feel that we should act sooner rather than later. Yes. The later that phoenix is trapped in with Lord Shadow, the more at risk it is for it to be experimented on with his soldiers. We have to get it out as soon as possible. Doctor, do you have anything to add to this? No. Anyway, I say let's end this chitty chatty and let's go get the phoenix. Okay, just please don't mention this to the kids. Okay. I'm Sadly, we do have the brains to figure it out. I sent aloe vera out on a mission, and I don't know if I really trust him or not. I don't, I don't really know. If <laughs> sent me out on a mission. What mission? I was working that day, so I know I didn't show up for recording. Or maybe you did diplomacy. I only hear, uh, boy, boy, I'm a baby, baby boy. So what was said? <laughs> what? It's, it's my bird! And it's funny how Sage said, I don't really trust uh, the kids around Ace. I thought that was funny. Oh, that guy in my chat. I'm so tired 
Oh, great. And let me give you some friendly advice. Something that I've had to take in. If you don't, if you don't know you can trust someone, you'll never know unless you try. All I'm saying is give them a chance. We'll bring him along. We'll see how it goes. Hey, under the cover. <laughs> I just hear your birds in the background. <laughs> Wait, what? I hear your birds. <laughs> oh, you actually hear the beep beep, uh, the peek a peek a peek a boo? Mm hmm. Okay, yeah. Get a turn into this when we come here, so whatever. Let's go. Yes, I know you're a baby boy. Can I watch this? No? Okay. Everybody else. I have no idea. He probably has them out somewhere. Listen, you want to be very quiet. Yeah. The dragon's out, but it's asleep. You do not want to wake that up. Yeah. Right? <sighs> Alright. Single file. Sage, you'll take up the front. Yep. Maniki, you'll take up the rear. The kids will be God. sandwiched in the middle along with uh, our friend here. No sign of the phoenix. You're no easy. <laughs> Get out of there. Get me back. <laughs> Y'all stand over here. Okay. Me and me and uh, Chris will check the inside. Y'all stay right here, okay? Okay. Be careful, mummies. We will. Mummies. Mummies. <laughs> Not even a guard. Not even a guard. As usual. I'm gonna check over here. Something doesn't seem right here. Nope. Hey, that brick texture looks pretty rad. Nothing <laughs> up here. Ah. ah, what? Huh? Huh? What was that? Sage! Where's Fred? I can't, I can't Anders! Come on, everyone. We have to go in after him. Go. Don't know where it goes. Go. Come on. Oh, maybe I was here. I think I was playing uh, uh, Kira's because I had to do the body acting, yeah? No. No, 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 no. Uh, wait a minute. I remember showing up yeah. at those parts right after work. This is where my friend Sonic died. Guys, 
What? In my old home. Is this your home? Yeah. Wait a second. He's supposed to be gone. Wasn't he supposed to be kidnapped, like, through the portal? He got pushed in. Oh, he got pushed yes, in. Yes, beep so beep, I'm a bird, but I can't hear a friggin' word. Oh, so he didn't, like, actually get, like, kidnapped or anything. No. He just Kira got pushed. pushed. Yeah, yeah. He got pushed by, he got pushed by Kira. Mm. Yeah. Why, what? Wasn't there a portal open behind us? There was. I mean, we're not, we're not royal nethers. We can't start that. And I'm not Shadow's head guard anymore, so I can't do it either. That universe's lore. Oh, okay. That's right, I'm the only one that really pays attention closely to the Minecraft mechanics when it comes into the RPs a lot of times, here. anyway. Mm. Okay, no big deal. We're just stuck in another place that I have no idea where we are at the moment. And I'm even more lost than I was! <laughs> so you have not been here in years. Dun, dun, dun. Well, first of all, we need to get off this festive mountain. I'm gonna try to remain extremely calm, calm here. I know you haven't been here in a while. Maybe underestimating a few things. But do you at least have a lay of the land? Yes. A wolf never forgets their territory. So... Which way? This way. <laughs> Just convenient a stairs behind the portal. Well, they used to live there. From old ruins. Yeah. I just thought I just thought it was funny that it was so convenient yeah. that Oh look! A stairs behind the portal. Oh, you know me, I would have commented and you know commentated all the way through it technically but I couldn't well there's a portal I don't know where it leads So their first mission was to go and get the Fire Phoenix just to check there, and now they're here. My question is, how are they going to get back? They should be fine. Right. And that's a big snake. Question is, where is where is everybody? Uh, Can you see? Because that is a good question. Didn't this place used to have more people? Yes, it did. Back in the days of the Red Cross. Hmm. This place looks flooded. Even the sign is flooded away. Just a little bit. Can you open up the door and leave the door open? 
Ouais. Yes. Uh, Sorry. <laughs> All right. If any, if any place I remember will have answers, probably it's the castle. Come on. I believe that's a good place to pause for at least this part. Mm -hmm. Since it's halfway through. Honestly, so to gather up, they went out to go and find the f the fiery phoenix, but instead, um, Maniki, King King Maniki, uh, got pushed into the portal by his daughter, and now they're in this place, and apparently it's Queen Sage's little, um, where she grew up, so... And now they're trying to figure out a way back home. So honestly, since this is going to be part one, um, I will do part two in just a little bit. But anyway, guys, this is going to be all for this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and leave a like if you guys haven't already. And make sure to um, at least comment down below if you guys are enjoying this. But without further ado, guys, I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys! Bye-bye!